and welcome back to another video. I am your host, the Goblin, or not just the Goblin, the Ice Goblin. And uh, I'm going to be showing you how to make your own simulator pits. Just like these two right here. I will show you the exact same design. This one's bigger. I don't know if you guys will want the uh, the bigger one or the smaller one. I don't know. I think the smaller one looks cooler because the the fire, you actually see it around it. But uh, let's get into the video. Alright, so what you want to do is you want to spawn it apart just like this. Drag it down to the bottom. Lift it up a tiny bit. Just like that. And then you want to uh, go to Insert Object, Special Mesh, scale it however you want it. I'm going to scale it like that. And then you want to uh, make it whatever color you want. I'm going to do like a uh, red and then you want to add fire if you want i don't know you can add sparkles or whatever but uh, let's go ahead and change the color of the fire to a bright yellow just like that and then whatever color or whatever eyes you want to add i want to do like some black eyes um You can add multiple, multiple of these as you want. Like I might do that, and then add some. No, no. Like a. Oh no. Um. Well. Then I'm gonna add a mouth or something. Just like that. Uh, I don't want that color though. Yeah, they're like that. Oh, I just added that to the whole base plate. Go ahead and delete that. And that part. Okay, let's get back down here. This is what it looks like so far. And then, uh, that's basically it after you. Uh, what's it called? After you customize your, or whoa, after you customize your pet, make sure you wanna, or make sure you name it pet enter, and then you want to insert an object. You want to insert a local script. I'm just gonna copy it and paste it. Make sure the second one, see, normally it's like that, it's like two, but you make sure that you wanna make sure that's not there. Let's go ahead and uh. Copy and paste this. I'm going to put it inside the description below. And copy. Paste. Just like that. You guys can pause the video and read it. Or you can go in the description. And look how you want to do it. But uh. Right here. You just want to click X on that. And then. That's not it. You want to insert a uh. A body gyro. And also. A body position and after that you want to make the the uh the max torque on it like this let me copy it paste you want to have a four and one two three four five four five six seven eight eight of those or eight zeros, just like that. And the body body position, you want to make it zero, 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 just like that. Enter. And then for the max force, instead of eight zeros, you want seven, just like that. Seven zeros instead of eight. And you want to start with the four again. And then that should be it. Let's go ahead and. Uh, click play. Oh, well, that one's way over here. Alright, now what you want to do is you want to go to the pet you just made. Um, that's not it. That might be it. Nope. Alright, it's probably this one. Yep, this one. 
you want to add it to your character then that way it should have added it yep just like that and it can follow you around let's go ahead and click off of it uh, yeah, that. That. all right and yeah it shouldn't have this box around it i just clicked it and it selected it but uh yeah it follows you around you can add sparkles to it oh and there's one more thing see how it's like hitting you and stopping you what you want to do if that's happening go uh to the pet go to the actual part don't really aim it and then you want to click can collide and after that you click play again let's go ahead and test it drag it into my person all right he should be up in here may take a little bit I don't know why it's not working right now. It just was, unless I dragged the wrong one, which is possible. No, it's in there. Let's go ahead and drag it again. Oh, wait. Okay, something just happened. I clicked play. I went to the actual pit. And, uh, where is it? This one right here. I drugged the wrong one. So you gotta make sure you have the right fire, the right color of your pet, because I already have a couple, and they're there. That's how you do it. Let's go ahead and unselect that. Click off that. Click off that. And then the workspace. And then you should have a pet that follows you, and you can actually go through it. You won't, it won't push you off stuff. And, uh, yeah. That's the end of the video. Leave a like, subscribe down below. And if you want more videos like this, um, this one, make sure you, uh, comment what you want me to do next. And, uh, if you, if I should do more videos like this, teaching you guys how to script and play games. I will see you in the next one. Later. Peace. Double out.